Hi today from Singen, Germany. Today we'll be talking about the Cantillon effect. See you in the next part. What is the Cantillon effect and where does it come from? Cantillon effect comes from an Irish-French economist called Richard Cantillon, who in 1730 published an essay on the nature of trade in general. And in that essay, he describes uh, the mechanics of money, of money creation and how it affects the economy. Cantillon states that when the money is created, it doesn't penetrate the economy in equal way in every area of the economy. It first gets uh, to the financial class, to the people who are close to the money, and uh, when they spend the money, depending on their preferences, it gets into these branches in these industries that uh, where they spend the money and then it somehow uh, goes or uh, flows through the economy uh, in waves step by step and of course money creation causes inflation but when the money is spent the first time uh, the people who spend the money uh, that got the money from the printer so to say uh, they buy the goods at low prices, at the old prices. But then the money gets to more and more people and the farther away you are uh, from the money, from the money creation, the higher the prices that you encounter. So the people at the end of that chain have to buy the same goods at higher prices. So they get the least advantage of that money. And there are people in the system that the money don't get to. And these people, they don't get any advantage of uh, that newly created money. On the other hand, the old money that is in the system, that is uh, owned by the people in the economy, this money gets inflated by the newly created money. So this is the Cantillon effect that says that the people who are closer to the uh, printer gets the most advantage of, uh, uh, of the money, of the newly created money. And the farther from the printer, the less advantage you get. And actually you are more and more in disadvantage because uh, the uh, old money that you possess gets inflated and you get only a small uh, percentage of the newly created money, so to say. So the Cantillon effect says that the people closer to the money get advantage of that money at the expense of people who are farther from the, uh, from the printer. And the wealth, the purchasing power is transferred away from these people, uh, further away from the printer, from the old money, so to say, uh, to the people with the uh, new money. And who are the people with the new money? Who are the people close to the printer? First of all, uh, the, of course, the banks. Uh, then, um, of course, financial institutions of other kinds. Then we have um, uh, the, the, the state itself. I mean, by issuing bonds and, um, so to say, getting freshly created money from the uh, purchases of the bonds or from uh, the central banks, uh, more or less directly or more or less indirectly. Uh, then we have, of course, state uh, companies and all the companies uh, that somehow enjoy the support of the state by subsidies, maybe by political uh, support uh, or financial support of the state of any art. Also, uh, government contractors. So these are the profiters of uh, this um, money creation and of Cantillon effect and who are uh, the losers of the uh, Cantillon effect of that phenomenon. Of course, the people who work for the money, who are at the end, so to say, of the food chain or the people who the new money doesn't reach, but they have to pay higher prices. So this is the Cantillon effect. Tell me where you observe the Cantillon effect. How can you take advantage maybe of that Cantillon effect? How can you use that in your life, in business? Leave a comment below this video. 
Give me a thumb up if you like this video, a thumb down if you didn't. Share this video with your loved ones, with your friend. One day they will thank you for that. I talk here a lot about economy, about business, about doing business on the highest level. I talk here about the best entrepreneurs in the world, how the self-made billionaires of our uh, world think and act. And I talk here also about money, about cryptocurrencies. So if you like this video, you will certainly like my other videos. I invite you to watch them. That's it for today from Singen, Germany. I wish you a fantastic day. Let's do something extraordinary today.